Hello, I'm Charlie and welcome to Authentic Mental Health, the channel that offers advice and friendly support within our like-minded community. Today's video is coming up right after this. Hypersexuality is also known as sexual addiction or sex addiction. Hypersexuality is a disorder where a person has sexual urges, fantasies and behaviours which are recurrent and intense. Someone suffering from hypersexuality disorders spends excessive amounts of time fantasizing and engaging in sexual behaviors. They also have no regard to the emotional and physical risks they pose to themselves or others. Let's take a short test now to see if you are likely or unlikely to be suffering from hypersexuality. I'm going to ask you five questions and you are going to answer with either yes or no. And at the end of the five questions, we'll find out what your scores mean. And if it comes back that you're likely to be suffering from hypersexuality disorders, we'll go through the options for you and what you can do to get help. The very first question is, do you masturbate more than you would like to or does it interfere with your life? Question two, do you have multiple sexual partners or do you frequently have one night stands? Question three, do you watch or read pornographic websites or magazines more than you would like to or does it interfere with your life? Question four, do you have trouble establishing or maintaining healthy, stable relationships? Question five, do you use masturbation as an escape from other problems such as anxiety, depression, stress, or loneliness? Let's now find out what your scores mean. If you said yes to two or less of those five questions, it's unlikely you have a hypersexuality disorder. However, if you said yes to three or more of those five questions, it's highly likely and possible you are suffering from a hypersexuality disorder. Now, please do not self-diagnose yourself from this test or any online test you can find on YouTube or the internet. Tests like these are designed to see if you are likely or unlikely to be suffering from whatever the test is based on. However, saying that, let's now discuss what options are available for you so you can get help. The first option is make an appointment with your, your doctor or the hospital or whatever country you're in where there are medical professionals so you can talk to them, they can diagnose you firstly, then they can advise you on what you can do to get help. The second thing you can do, there's a link in the description box down below for you to talk to someone right now, straight away about your problems. There are online counseling and therapy website where they can diagnose you. You can talk to them from the comfort of your own home. All you need is a mobile device, an iPad, a computer, anything with internet on and you can access it and talk to a professional. They're available 24 seven, every minute of the day. If you're interested, the link's in the description box down below. Let me know in the comment section down below what you scored on this test. And if you're comfortable telling myself and others, have you ever been diagnosed with a hypersexuality disorder? If you're comfortable, let us know in the comment section down below. If you've enjoyed this video and found it useful, please give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe to Authentic Mental Health for more content like this again in the future. Take care guys and girls and I'll see you tomorrow for another video.